the run up to my 50th birthday, I wrote a long, long post going through 50 things I discovered on the run up to my birthday and just in life in general. Now, maybe at some point, maybe I'll do a series of videos talking about each of those, but I'll just take one out of the list because it's one that I see a lot of people making a mistake with. And that is thinking that filling their head with knowledge is progress. That if they read the books, if they study the courses, if they watch all the YouTube videos, all the TikTok videos, that means you're taking action. That doesn't. There's gaining knowledge and then there's taking action. And what I found is that when you actually take action, you'll probably find that the majority of knowledge that you're gaining right now is going to be useless. You're never going to use it. You know, when we look back at school, you know, all the subjects we have covered at school, how many of those do we really use nowadays? You know, if I was to cut it down to the basics, I think getting out of school, the things I use every day is reading, writing, and maths. Those three things. Now, unless maybe I was going to do something specific down one of those kind of subjects, the rest of it is just complete nonsense. It's just taking up space in the hard drive in my mind, and I know for a fact I'll never use it. In fact, I probably have forgotten all of it. And that's what I think a lot of us unfortunately do is we fill our heads with knowledge, too much knowledge, and we don't take action on it. What I found over the years, when it came to my fiction writing, when it came to starting a podcast, when it came to recording these videos, the most, the greatest way to learn anything for me was actually taking action. It was trying to write a book, getting to a point where I just couldn't get further, learning to get past that point, and then moving on until I came to the next hurdle, and then find out the information I needed to get past that hurdle. So what I simply needed to do was I just needed the knowledge just to get me past those kind of, you know, roadblocks. And I didn't need all the rest of the knowledge. And you're going to find that's the same with you as well too. If you take action, what I'd recommend is just tossing the books away, tossing away the courses, ignoring YouTube and TikTok and any other platform until you actually come to a specific point when you're taking action that you can't go beyond. And you're thinking, how do I get beyond this point? Then go to Google then go to YouTube, find out how you need to get past that point, discover how to do it, and then take action from that point onwards until you come to another stalling point. Because for a long time, I believe that filling my head with knowledge, buying the books, courses, the eBooks, all those different things, was me getting progress. I wasn't closer to writing my book. I wasn't closer to doing my podcast. I wasn't closer to recording my video. And the only way I got those things done was with taking action. So don't confuse knowledge with taking action. They're not the same thing. Action is always action. And if I was to focus on either of those, I would focus on the action until I can't take any more action, then I'd gain some knowledge, and then I would be straight back to taking action again. So don't confuse the two. Don't think filling your head with knowledge is progress. It's not progress unless it's used. And you will find the majority of knowledge you have in your head right now is useless. You're never going to use it. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye.